for today's creative brief, we want you to celebrate your strengths and expose your weaknesses. We want you to do a half and half makeup. And this week, there are no models. Your face is your canvas. You have two and a half hours and your time starts now. Half and half makeup is a huge online trend. The MUA wannabes will have to create two distinct looks on one face. The split doesn't need to be straight down the middle, but the judges will want to see two clear looks that represent both the seen and unseen sides of their personality. It's really weird because normally when I do my makeup, I'll have you like down here on a phone screen. Me. Watching your videos. Oh, we can do that. But instead of this time. Wait, I can do that. You're here in my mirror. Hello, guys. It's me, <laughs> Kiki. Hello. So today we're doing a tutorial on this beautiful ninja turtle. <laughs> oh my God. Good job. Thank you. Lee's two-face look reflects how his life is affected by self-doubt and colour blindness. Ellis. Ellis is pale, but is it yellow? Because I'm behind me. I'm behind me looking like you're always really yellow, yeah. And a bit pale. Not happy with his skin tone colour match, Lee decides to start from scratch, costing him valuable time. Lee Lee. Hello. Hello. I noticed you just sort of took off your makeup. Yeah, what's, so go what's going on? I'm struggling to match my skin tone under this light. Right. I struggle with it anyway, being cold blind, but when I put it on, it just looks a bit too yellow. Okay. So I'm trying again. So, what colours can't you see? Uh, I struggle with red, is the biggest. So, anything with red in, so brown and green look the same, uh, blue and purple look the same, but skin tones is the hardest for me. Because the nuances are so minute, but it can make such a big difference if you get it wrong. Yeah. Good luck. Can't wait to see it. understand what it is people with color blindness see because it I mean it must be such such a surreal world but it's all that they've known but on here I feel like I'm not seeing what it's like to be colorblind that look doesn't give me color blind at all Emmy ways you are halfway through MUAs, finishing touches. Oh. That's it, time's up. Down with your brushes. Lee. I'm fascinated by colour blindness because we live in a world of colour and I don't know what you see. I want to see what you see. I want to see that in this. But this isn't the half and half story that we were looking for. Okay. I love how it's becoming veiny and part of the skin here. And then I'm like, why didn't you implement that here? What's happening here, you know? So the idea is there, but you just gotta take it up a notch to let everyone see it. Okay, thank you. Thank you. 